his deal. It's a cop right there. I bet he's looking at me too. I bet he's looking. Hey man, it's green, stupid. Go. The light's green. What you doing? Oh, sorry, it was green on that side. You had the green light over there just a minute ago. Oh, he's going to a call. Hope you get shot. Can't stand the police. Well, there is one particular sergeant in this on this police force here that I do thoroughly care about, I guess, if I if I would say that. Uh, you know, Ricky don't talk too much about his feelings, but I guess if I'm going to get into him, we'll talk about Sergeant Gibson, who just had so happens to be my favorite sergeant in the game, and probably the only official police officer here uh, in this state that I that I get along with. It's always been cordial with me, and uh, you know, so yeah. He's the only one. Every other cop can 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 kiss my dare here a bear. They can kiss a bear. Well, we gotta find us a car, cause I ain't got one. I'm just gonna take this in here. Ain't nobody using it. No way. Make sure ain't no cop right there. Yeah, we'll just take this one. Ain't nobody around. Unless there's a cop sitting over there. If there is, I'm busted now. It's too late. Took long enough to fasten the seatbelt. I hit the button like 10 seconds ago. Hurry up, man. I gone. All right, so we're gonna head over to uh, the garage, I guess. I, I'm, I'm assuming uh, with the fact that, uh, uh, how do I say this? Um, I heard the, the the system here in Sandy got got hacked and and uh, everything got wiped out. So that means the registration on my vehicles ain't no longer existent in the system. So I gotta go redo all that junk. Ain't even my fault. So what's the speed limit on this stupid road? So like 35, yeah, it's 35. There it is, right there. Hurry up, man. You creeping, bro. Hurry up. Can you go a little faster, man? You ain't even doing the speed limit, stupid. God, I can't stand doing the speed limit. I'm ruthless. Ain't no cops around this area anyway, I don't think. I hope not. I sure hope not. Watch out, man. Stupid idiot. So, we're gonna head on over here to the garage and, uh, see if maybe my car's still there. Maybe it is. I might just have to re-register it, but I don't know. Half the things I own get impounded or, or you know... I wreck them or something, you know. Hope the guy on my bike is still over here because that's about the only thing I have that really means anything to me is my bike, you know, my motorcycle. I don't ride no bicycles. I mean, I have, but, you know, I'm, I'm a grown man now, you know, so I want to ride a, but, uh, I want to ride my motorcycle. you guys are having a great week and, uh, you know, as, as, uh, as criminal justice, what well, y'all call him what, CJ? As CJ would say, I hope y'all are having a great week Hope y'all are happy and where you want to be in life and that you're in a consistent prayer with God or some kind of meditation, yada, 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 all that sappy stuff. I don't get into that. Ricky don't do the sappy stuff. He don't do that. He just don't. Ricky's not, uh, Ricky's not a sappy guy, to be honest about it. He just really ain't. But, you know, nonetheless, I do hope you guys are having a good week. Hope you guys are enjoying CJ's content. Yeah, he's a good YouTuber. He's a he's a pretty good YouTuber. I know uh, I spoke with him uh, uh, a few days ago. Yeah, he's got a big goal this year. He, he's wanting to uh, 
Is the radio on on this stupid truck? My guy's bobbing his head like an idiot. There we go. Okay. So I spoke with CJ a few days ago, and I know he said he had a big goal for this year for his channel. He's wanting to hit 100K. That is 100,000 subscribers. That's, that's a lot, but, you know, he's already at almost 27,000. I don't think he's got far to go. Maybe less than 100 subs to go to 27. So he's, he'll get there. CJ's good people. He's a good person. Oh, we got somebody over here. Hey, what's good, man? I'm good, you? Pretty good, man. What's going on? You just hanging out down here or something? Yeah, I'm just sorting my DV stuff out, you know. Oh, yeah, I got you. I couldn't ever get a car myself, man. I'm got my bike parked in the garage. Hopefully it's still there. Uh, if it's, it probably will be. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard the system got hacked or something like that, man. Everything got reset. Yeah. Well, that sucks. So I guess I got to go buy a new bike then, huh? Yep. All right. All right, man. Well, hey, have a good night, man. Be careful out here. It's a crazy place, dude. <laughs> you too, bro. All right, man. All right, well, the... Well, that sucks. The the car is definitely not going to be... Uh, the bike, I mean. Not the car, but the... My bike ain't going to be there. So we're going to have to go get a bike and... And do all that, we gotta go to the ATM. Daggone, I'll just bring y'all back into the video once we get the, uh... Once I get everything I need, I'll bring y'all back in. Alright, so we got everything we needed, but then, you know, I, I find out here that... I guess they've sent in some construction workers or something to rebuild the city a bit, county. And there's only one dealership around this place. And my stomping ground is Sandy Shores. Now, if I'm wrong, I'll stand corrected on this, but I'm pretty sure... If we look on the GPS here, and I go up to car dealership, there's only one. So why would they take the one? They closed the one down on Route 68. It's not there. I drove down there. It's not there. They expect everybody in Sandy to just drive all the way down here to get a car? That's about the dumbest thing I've ever seen. I mean... You live in different parts of the state. People live in different counties and different cities. You know, you're not going to have a, McDo a McDonald's, uh, you know, that's going to be, you know, two hours away and everybody from that certain state is going to drive to that one McDonald's to get their food. You got to have one in every county. It's the same with a dealership. Why would they do that? I just, that's beyond me. That is beyond me. Anyway, I'm not waiting on these red lights. I know they're going to come back and watch this. It's okay. They can ticket me later. This ain't even my car, I stole it, so. It's ridiculous to think that we really have to drive all this way to buy a car or a motorcycle, whatever you're getting, but you gotta drive all this way to do it, it's stupid. It's the dumbest thing. Now, I will say this. I will say this, The uh, my wallet looks a lot better. It's a lot more organized. It most definitely is. But, uh, I don't know. I just don't know. But we're going to go to the car dealership here, guys. I'm going to get my motorcycle. I'm going to register it. And, uh, that's, that's what we're doing. I was hoping to go to the, the one on 68 and take care of it there. But, of course, uh, they took it out. They closed it down. I guess it's close for renovations or something. I, I, I don't know. I really don't care. All I know right now, it's got me ticked off. And uh, because that dealership up there, I know I'm not the only one that loves that dealership. I'm not the only one that uses it. And if I can ever get my seatbelt off of me so I can get out of this godforsaken car, stupid piece of junk. I hate that car. It's stupid. Let me go in here. Since, since us folks that live all the way in Santa Guy drive all the way to Los Santos. I hate this city. This city is stupid. It's retarded. So we got to come all the way down here just to buy a vehicle. And ain't even nobody here. We are at the right spot, are we not? We are. All right, guys. So we're going to head on back to uh, 
Sandy and uh, Polito. Yeah, we're we're gonna we're gonna get some gas, but uh, I'm gonna try to find something to get into. Maybe find somebody to run into. Yo, did somebody just wreck back there? I thought I just seen somebody just wreck. We gotta get some gas. There goes there goes police officer right there. All right, let's go ahead and. Uh, Shut her down. What are you flashing your blue lights at? I know you ain't trying to pull me over. Back on the bike. Can I help you? This dude legit just pulled me over for no reason. I will fight a cop. If this happens again, I will I will fight a cop. I will fight him. Can I help you? Yeah, man. Everything okay? I mean, yeah. Why are you pulling me over? I saw you come ramping over that uh, that dirt mound over there, man. No, nah, I wasn't ramping. I come up over it nice and easy, man. I don't know what you're talking about. You couldn't use the entrance? What was that wrong with the big entrance back there? There was. That is an entrance. It's in. It comes into the parking lot. It's an entrance. So you didn't come over the side by that rock there? I just want to make sure you're not, you know, you got control of the bike, man. I, I just want to make sure you're Listen, good. man, I'm good. I'm just cruising. I want you to just leave me alone. Get back in the vehicle right there and leave me alone. I'm just cruising, man. That's all I'm it's, doing. It's it's not even like that, man. I mean, I was going to leave you alone, and you know. Well, you're still going to leave me alone because you ain't got, even got no reason to pull me over to begin with. I, I'm making sure. Yeah, I have a reason. You came over that mound pretty hard there, buddy. Bro, I didn't come right. over the mound hard. I came over it nice and easy. I was doing like five mile an hour when I pulled in that thing. All right. Well, either way, you missed the entrance completely. Okay. Well, you want to go back and take a look at it with me? Yeah, let's go. We okay, let's there. do it. You talking about like this little dirt road up here? Right here. You came right between the rock and that rail, did you not? Well, I know I came over a little dirt hill right here. Yeah, okay. This is why I'm checking on you because this is not an actual entrance. I don't know if you knew that. Okay, well, it's open. I mean, it looks like an entrance to me. All right, well, you gotta. This is this is you gotta see where I'm coming from here, man. This is why I, I'm checking on you. No, I see where you're you know coming you're from. I'm good to go, man. Okay. Yeah. What's your name, man? Ricky. Ricky, last name? York. Okay. All right. All right, okay. Man, uh, listen, I'm checking on you only because you came over this little dirt mound here. That's the only reason. Okay, and you, I'm you telling you I'm good. I ain't had nothing you, to drink. If that's what you're assuming, I've had nothing to drink. I don't have any that's weapons. That's I'm checking. That's I just want checking. to ride my bike and, and cruise. That's all I want to okay. do. I want you to ride your bike, too, but I need to make sure you're doing it in a safe manner, okay? Okay, well, so, I... I won't come between that right there anymore, but y'all need to block it off. Um, I, I don't work for that department. I'm sorry, sir. Okay, well, I mean, the guardrail, you know, kind of starts here, goes back this way. That's open. I mean, it's kind of like the bikes that ride in between the lanes. You know, we ride in between lanes. That's legal. Okay, but you missed an entrance completely, so that that's... That's where my concern I, played yeah, in. Yeah, so. I get I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. Can I just go? I really don't want to stand here and confrontate with you about this. It's not worth my time. You can you can hold on a second. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, run your name. Uh, listen, Mr. York, I was gonna let you go, nice and easy. I, I don't understand. What this is. Sure, you you're you're gonna have to say that again, man. You sound real choppy to me, man. You got sound like you got something in your throat, if you know what I mean. Do I sound better? There you go. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and run you real quick. 
Just hang here with my sheriff. I'll be right back, all right? It's going to take two seconds. I'll send you on your way. Jesus, man. Sheriff, his, uh, his bike is over here. I just saw him come through this little crack here. Yeah, I literally just yeah, bought it like I just bought the bike. I got gotcha. you. Be right back. Wow, man. Because I came through a little entrance. Are you new? You new, man? No, sir. No? What's your name? Deputy McCutcheon. What's your badge number? 19. Deputy what? What was that again? Deputy what? Deputy McCutcheon. All right. You normally you normally work county out here, man? I'm usually in this area. Which I know I didn't. I came in about five mile an hour. But then he's trying to pull this little thing about, well, you missed the entrance entirely, so whatever that's all about. So we were walking back up here so I could show him where I came in at and showed him that I didn't jump. I mean, there's practically no hill to jump there. I mean, you're going quick. I get off this one right behind me. It's a bunch of rocks, though. Surprised you got a bike. <clears throat> yeah, but I mean, you know, motorcycle riders are a lot different than car riders. You know, it's, it's a lot different. Like, like I was explaining to him, you know, bikes yeah, can all, ride in between the lanes here out here on, on, the, on, the, on the highways. They can ride between the lanes. Why you guys got three cops showing up out here? What What is this? You're good, man. You're good. I'm going to let you go here in a second. Okay, let, let me go then, man, because you you're really starting to bug me, man. Hey, listen. Uh, well, Mr. York. Hey, is that is me. that Sergeant Gibson back there? Let me talk to him. I almost talked hold to on, him. Hold on. Listen, now, I'm going to talk to him. Sir. Hey, are you Sergeant Gibson? Sir, don't I'm walk not done away talking from to us. you. Well, I'm done talking I'm to you, man. You're harassing me at this point. All right, well, listen. You want to know the reason for the harassment? You don't have a valid motorcycle license. I do. No, you do not. Yes, I do. <laughs> Are you really going to argue with me on this? I just checked. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure I, I put that in. I, okay, well, listen. If it was a mistake by the DMV's part, today is uh, we're having a grace period, okay? So you're in luck. I just want to inform you. All right, no need for the hostility, man. You got to calm down a little bit. No, but you got to understand motorcycle ride. Like, listen, man. Out here on these highways, we can ride between vehicles in these lanes. But cars can't do that, am I right? Mr. York, I don't care if you're in a motorcycle, a truck, a car, a van. It doesn't matter. You have to come through the entrance. I'm not harassing you. I'm not giving you a ticket. I'm not saying anything beyond that. I'm going to hand you back your ID. I'm going to ask you to be more careful when you're pulling into the driveway. And that's it. And get your uh, motorcycle license situated. That's it, man. I don't want any more problems with you. There's nothing else, all right? Okay. That's good. Okay. All right. Man, so, I ride a bike, and I'll be honest, I'm surprised you got through here. I mean, you just got to know what the all there is to it. Uh, I'm going to be honest with you. It didn't sound like you knew what you're doing. I, you caught my attention. I heard you kind of bump in here pretty hard. So, Dude, I literally came in that spot right there at five miles an hour. Okay. I mean, I've got it on my, my dash cam. keeps track of my speed and everything. I can I can show it to you if you want. No, 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 no. You're, you're fine, like I said. I don't care beyond that. I just wanted to make sure you're okay. And hey, Sergeant Gibson. Is that Sergeant Gibson over there? I'm done with this guy. We're good to go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You just want to finish oh. up with these guys here? Yeah, I'll finish up with them. Okay. Ricky, be careful. That's all I got for you, man. I will. All right, man. Take care. Yep, you too. Yeah. These cops pull you over for literally nothing. Nothing. I ought, to kip, I ought to kick this cop car. I should take off with it. Out of character? This is why I don't create multiple characters because there's a reset every once in a while and then you gotta go back and you gotta you gotta recruit you gotta you got to re-register all your characters. It's 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 a it's a pain in the dairy era. It really is. It's it's a pain in the dairy era. I don't know. I don't know why he thought that my license was not in the system or what he's smoking. But my license are clear. I mean, I'm I am triple checking my license, and 
My license are good. I have a vehicle registration. Guys, I have a license. My, my license are legit. They were when he ran them. And they, when they ran my license, I, I don't know if it's where the system got hacked or, or if it's still kind of janky or well, what. Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to do it for this episode of SLRP. Uh, be sure you subscribe to CJ's channel if you haven't already and smash that like button for him. Also, make sure if you want to uh, catch future content and future live streams, as he does live stream Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday here at 6 o'clock Central Standard Time, uh, be sure to ring, uh, click that uh, bell, ring the bell, and click all. That being said, guys and girls, uh, I'll do CJ's classic sound off. God bless. Take care. Stay in prayer. Love one another. And peace out.